Hey Canada, welcome to Take 3. We've got the funniest, weirdest, most interesting stories from Narcity and around the internet that you're going to want to share in your group chat. I'm Alex Melky, today is March 9th, and I have three stories in three minutes for you. You are not going to believe this. Check this out. There is a massive royal controversy in the news right now, and I am not talking about how the British royal family was nervous, apparently, that Meghan Markle and Prince Harry's son would be born a little too dark. What? Three minutes is nowhere near enough time to unpack all of that. No, I'm talking about the Burger King. Or more specifically, that on International Women's Day yesterday, the brand tweeted out, Women belong in the kitchen. Now that was followed up by two more tweets that dive into the fact that apparently only 20% of chefs in the UK are women, and that Burger King is trying to create more opportunities for female chefs in the UK with the new scholarship. The only issue is that the first tweet about women belonging in the kitchen, that got hundreds of thousands of likes. The other two, not so much. A ton of people called Burger King out on their attempt at an edgy tweet on International Women's Day. Didn't really pan out for them, including KFC's gaming Twitter account, which apparently is a thing. Which eventually led to Burger King deleting the original post and, you guessed it, saying they're sorry and that they promised to do better. If I had a nickel for every time a brand said that, I'd be rich. An Ontario dealership is thankful that their employee is still alive after he was nearly run over. At around 6 p.m., a guy walks into a sports motors dealership on Oxford Street East looking to buy a new BMW. At first, he's checking out the car, he likes what he sees so far, but he tells the sales rep he's gotta make a quick call. A split second later, the BMW is barreling down towards the dealership employee and cameras caught the whole thing. You can actually see the sales rep clinging onto the hood of the car as it drives off the lot before falling into traffic and almost getting hit by a second car. Surprisingly though, he was taken to the hospital with only minor injuries. If 2020 has taught us anything, it's that sometimes things don't happen exactly the way you plan them. But what really counts is your attitude and how you deal with it. Hey, what's up? I think I just broke my back. But I'm having a great time. Never giving up, even when things just aren't going your way. <laughs> Because eventually, you'll figure it out. And that is it for today, March 9th, 2021. Thank you for making it to the very end. And listen, if you have a video clip that you want to share with the rest of Canada, slide into my DMs on Instagram, at Alex Melky. And if it's good enough, it might just make it into the next episode. I'll see you Thursday.